everyone and welcome back to part four of let's play the sims 4 the black widow challenge with me little miss simmer so now i've got the audio working again i'm hoping this part won't be labby, laggy af um but yeah so we're going to go ahead in this part and we are going to plan the wedding um i'm not going to make it a formal wedding because i cannot be bothered to get a medal for it um we might do it next time or something which might even fall in love in the end and actually um, not want to steal a man's money and then we can have a proper wedding I don't know but seeing as we just had one for the dinner party I felt like I was too focused on trying to get the award and not actually you know doing the challenge so I'm not going to do a medal um, for this one so it's not going to be prestige or scored it's just going to be a wedding we are the bride and groom of course and we right well I need to do it with Scarlet because Scarlet has more friends so yeah let's go ahead and plan a social event and then after the wedding we will go and we will find we'll go and find our victim well our next one to cheat on this current victim with so we're gonna have not a weenie roast we're gonna have a wedding and um we're gonna have everyone there that we know hopefully we'll know more people as time goes along we'll have Bianca Celestino Celeste Eno really right okay um <laughs> and we'll have actually no we'll have her as a mixologist and we'll have Dan as our caterer and we'll have Olivia Walters as our musician we're going all out and I think we should have it at uh I placed down a I place down a chapel is it gonna let me have a the chapel though um i don't see the chapel here why can't we have it at the chapel right maybe if we go to the chapel it will um it will it will say current location because i want to have it at the chapel i i placed on a chapel so i want to use it we'll travel with him and we'll go there and we'll plan our wedding event and we will get married we don't have to get married i don't think that's the requirement of the challenge um but i guess we should because it makes it more twisted to be honest um it makes it more fun and it gives us more things to do we can pick and choose which ones you want to marry i guess um really to get his money all we have to do is move him in so yeah so we'll plan our wedding event now and we'll see if it will let us um have it here at this loving that loving lovely venue that i got from the gallery right oh we'll do this all over again this all over again why can't we just have it where we are for christ's sake oh so frustrating i built a freaking i built a freaking right i'm gonna go into manage world it's absolutely rubbish um I had everything freaking planned and then it's just not letting me have it there. So we can make her a nice little outfit now. So before we do anything, no you are not wearing that. No way. <laughs> Let's um I don't know if testing cheats is on, but I'll turn it on anyway. cheats are enabled we're gonna go make her a nice wedding outfit we're gonna make her look stunning every single time because that's just scarlet that's all of the Mavro sisters yeah. they are just stunning by name so i'm assuming this is gonna be some kind of formal attire uh right i'm thinking maybe this dress hmm. mm, perhaps or even in this dress but her curves are looking she's looking like an apple right now in that dress uh or maybe this she is the black widow so i think she should wear black what's the difference between that one and this one 
there is no difference she does look great in that though but I don't like the dress itself I like this one so I think I'm gonna have her in this not that dress I'm gonna have her in this dress and we'll do her hair something nice and funky maybe just for the wedding something different something that matches though that's no that's that's not it no I really don't like that hair I need to uninstall that uh, or we could just keep her hair the same it was like a red colour wasn't it I think I'll just keep her hair the same because otherwise I'm not going to remember what I had it as yeah because she looks beautiful with that hair she looks beautiful right I don't think should we change her makeup up a little bit I don't know let's take it all off we'll give her some nice makeup that looks nice and we'll have the usual blusher on um we can have dark shimmery lips so we can have black lips black goth or we could have red no I can't like the black it suits, it suits her gothic you know look and then something like this over her eyes maybe yes goth bride yes i freaking love it so <laughs> this is gonna be her attire for her wedding oh god she should wear her wings she should wear her wings when she's getting married oh no it's too late now we'll have her wear her wings next time so here we are why are you not wearing it you change outfit formal two <laughs> right this is her wedding outfit and somewhere within this park we're gonna go and get married I think this is a really nice spot we're gonna have to place down a wedding arch otherwise this is not it's not gonna happen is it so let's go into garden activities and we'll place down this beautiful wedding arch here in front of the pond and we will get married this is not how it was supposed to be planned out at all but <laughs> this is the sims for you so let's go and get married please i want to what's the best angle right maybe through through i can't talk through through the wedding arch like this maybe like this yes Do 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 do. Is anyone even watching? Yes. I don't know why. Like this is such a big moment. She's gonna get married like twenty times. He looks like he totally doesn't suit her. Everyone's come to watch. Even oh my god, lady, who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? Seriously, this is such a mess, right? We'll, we'll watch it from here and then and then we can see. <laughs> Under the wedding arch. Marriage is taking place. On goes the rings. And there's the kiss. With the confetti coming down. And now they're married, I think. What am I doing? Right. Are they married now? Yes. Wow, so many screenshots. Right, I think they're married. Right, so I think they're I think they're married now. Yes, they are spouses. They are going to go and kiss somewhere for some reason. We don't have a cake to cut because I've completely unplanned to have it here, so I think 
it's time to find our next victim so this guy let's thank him for coming do an impression of him brighten his day brag about possession seeing as blondes are totally her type give him a pickup line gossip with him even though silver is totally like ruining it Right. Ask about his day, how about a compliment? This is, I think this guy is with someone and that's why it's not working. So let's try let's try this guy. Brooke, you are looking gorgeous girl. Thank you for coming, girl. In your lovely blue outfit, you water sim. Right, let's try this guy. Offer him a rose, kiss his hands. At our wedding ceremony, because that's how the Black Widow rolls. Right, so we got a little bit of, we're a tiny bit of romance with this guy, so we will keep it at that, and we will, we will, is he, is he a friend now? Yes. This is the guy from before, what we had when we killed Christian. Um, so yeah. So why don't we say hello to Mama, we thank Mama for coming, and we will gossip with her, deep conversation with her, and tell her a bit of a joke, or maybe flatter, like, Mom, you're looking good. You'll look even better when you're immortal. Yeah, for some reason he's very angry. Flirty spouse. Peter's spouse was flirting with another. Have they been doing this behind his back? No, it's only just started. But you're going to die soon, so who cares? Right, let's head home. Let's go home. Can we go home? Why can't we go home right now? We're married. We're going home. We can't leave. This is not a social event anymore. Right, let's, oh, here we go. End early. There we go. Now we can leave. Now we can go home. So let's. No, let's go home. 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 We're running home to make preparations for the next kill. Right guys, so we've got caught cheating at our own wedding day and we made him very angry. It is time to bring <laughs> Peter Gardner here and it's time to kill him. So we need to get him to go inside here because it's time for him to die. And I forgot, to, totally forgot to put a hot tub um, back down here. I need to put something for her to do down here while he dies. Well, she only needs to stay in the house really, but... Right, so I've taken the gate away. He is trapped in the chamber to die. While we chillax at home, we can't leave the lot because he's because he's got to die, of course. We could actually kill him in the swimming pool. Actually, should we kill him in the swimming pool this time? Because this kind of takes a while. But then I've done it now. Yeah, so let's instead of instead of doing him in the swimming pool, we're doing him in the swimming pool next time, I promise, guys. Let's invite over our next our next victim. So let's invite him to hang out our current lots, and we can get this going. He said he's going to be right over. I need to pretty good. She just needs to have something to eat. Um, but he'll be here any minute that he is. So let's get flirting with him. We'll offer him a rose, kiss his hands, give him a compliment brag about possessions get over here girl still in your wedding attire and we'll get flirting with him a heartfelt compliment get to know him ask risque question and discuss interests complain about TV size flirt with him embrace him Something embarrassing Vanessa? happened. <laughs> Being equipped. And confess attraction. Oh. To a quink knees and rib. <laughs> right, so ah, Poga we can ask him on a date. Oh crazy. Oh. oh. With Tuni Tarb. Squad. Hey, Did he just say no? <laughs> Did he just fucking say no? How fucking dare you? Right. We need to try flirting with him again. This guy's interesting. Ask the Scott no, we're not doing stargazing. <laughs> Oh my god, dude! Right, maybe we need to be a bit more friendly. Maybe we need to be a bit more friendly. 
Jaraza. God, we're killing someone for you. Don't fuck with me. <laughs> we're killing someone for you. We want your money, dude. He's a stay-at-home dad. You loser. What's, where's your career? Pick up line. Joke about politicians even though he looks like one. Discuss interests. Right, we'll just keep going with this. I wonder how he's getting on downstairs. You dying yet? He dying yet? No, he's only a little bit hungry. Still got a while to go until until he dies. Do a sexy pose. No, we're not gushing about partner. We're about to kill him. Um, compliment his appearance. Ask him if he's single. Smooth recovery. Embrace him. He is single. Wow. Oh no, I was going to say that. Fucking shut up quick. <laughs> um, should we go in the hot tub for a bit, guys? Let's go in the hot tub. So let's... We're here in the hot tub with. We can only do it with Peter and Peter's dying. So we'll go and skinny dip together in the hot tub. Because that's a f about as flirty as it gets. She's just got her wings out in the hot tub. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Why are you not getting in the hot tub now? Go. Please. You can both get in it. Ooh. Right, we'll make a move on him. And confess our attraction to him. And we will deep conversation with him. Make a move, because she didn't just do it just then. And we will tease flirtatiously. Whisper sweet nothings. Snuggle with him. Blow him a kiss. Snuggle. Oh, guys. Confess, kiss with him, embrace him, invite to stay the night. Stay the night with me while I'm killing my husband in the basement. Because that's what kind of twisted shit goes on here. Only we know it, guys. Only we know it. Poor little Devon is completely oblivious. We'll ask him to be... We'll, oh, I swear they just first kissed already. Woohoo in the hot tub. Do it. Again, he's wearing his clothes. Are you self-conscious? <laughs> She's keeping her wings on. <laughs> I guess, you know, she is a fallen angel. She She's the devil, all right. Right, he's, he's nowhere near death yet. He's very angry. <laughs> you don't even know what's going on up here. You don't even know. You're downstairs dying. Ooh, listen to that steam. Why don't we make out? Look deeply into his eyes. Whisper sweet nothings. Uh, we're not trying for a baby. Give him a massage and tickle him. This is totally a glitch right here. It's got to be. Right, she needs to pee. So go and pee then, girl. Go to the toilet and serve up some food for you and your new man. He won't be your new man for long. Serve some grilled cheese, even though I don't really want you to get fat, but, you know, all this woohooing, you're going to lose some pounds. You're going to drop some pounds there. Right, where is she then? Where is she? She's in the loo. Right, I want you to go and make some food. I'll have a quick meal then. We'll have some oatmeal. Seeing as it's too late to serve dinner now. The option has gone. We'll have some oatmeal with some little fruits on it. I love the food in this game. It's so good. <laughs> We're just going to eat her oatmeal. Probably in the garden. No. Nope. She's going to sit down in the dining area and eat it today. I want to get a picture of eating this oatmeal. It looks so cool. With the little berries and the little bits of apples on. I love it. 
<laughs> She's eating her oatmeal. I don't know what Devon's doing. He's going in our fridge. She's nearly finished eating. Woohooed in the hot tub. Is it hot in the hot tub or is it scarlet? Trick question. It's both. Of course it was. Oh, look, they're going to have a little chat, even though she's finished her meal and she needs to go to sleep so bad. I guess I can flirt a little more. Sexy pose. So, so. <laughs> um, we can't really ask him to be our boyfriend yet because we're still technically married, I think. I think we are. Yeah, pretty much. They're just lovebirds, so we can't really ask him yet. We'll ask him when, we'll ask him when he's died. Confess attraction. Give him a pickup line. They just love each other, don't they? I'm gonna flirt with him. Right, I do think you need to go to bed now, girl. Sleep it off until until he dies. He's about to pee himself. Which is always nice. And we're off to bed. Hopefully when we're up in the morning he will be he will be dead. That rhymes. We're off to bed. Hopefully when we wake up in the morning, Peter will be dead. Yes. What are you doing? No, go to sleep. Nighty night. Sleep tight. Don't let the black widow bite. <laughs> that would be such a good one. So good. Right, we. I don't. I swear, I had a bed. I had a bed in that room. I don't know where that's gone. We still. We still have everything else. We can't get burgled in this game. I'm sure. There's no like. Oh, look at him swimming in the pool, honey. Be careful. The black widow might take away the stairs. <laughs> Because there's no way out other than the stairs. What if he actually dies, like properly dies by accident, and we didn't even get his money? Do you reckon he knows how to get out? Do you reckon he knows how to get out? I'm stuck. I'm slightly concerned that he's not getting out. I'm slightly. We we can't. You can't die. He he would not be in the pool that long. Right. Just in case he does actually want to escape. He just peed in the pool. No, he could use the stairs. He just he just he just wanted to do a swim for a very long time. So guys, it's the moment of truth. Peter is dying from starvation. And it's kinda of awkward because uh, uh, our new our new guy is here. But yes, he he's dying now and the Grim Reaper has come to take him away. So guys, yeah, that is that's the end of that's the end of Peter. So it's just oh, us and Scarlet now, so I think it's time to um go and Ask him to be our boyfriend and move him in. So let's do that now. So let's be friendly and ask him to move in. We are loaded. Our husband's just died. Of course, she's going to be sad. Um, but yeah, so he's going about to move in with us. I don't know if we'll get his funds because he's with a family. Um, but I hope we get something from him. Otherwise, that's just kind of pointless. Uh, so yeah. So unfortunately, we didn't get any funds from him because there's still a glitch where if you take someone from a family and they have household funds all together you don't get anything so we've got tons anyway guys so i'm not entirely bothered i really wasn't expecting to have all this freaking money um but yeah so he's moved in with us now yes. so he's gonna go and make us some food but i'm just gonna have her go to bed and like cry it out before she starts taking out on him and then everything is ruined um we've managed to get him to be our boyfriend after him previously like hating us 
so yeah we're just gonna keep like crying it out and everything and then we need to go down and we need to put the door back on the back on the chamber and um the grim reaper's trapped in there uh -huh. we need to go and uh get his grave and put it in the uh put it in the cemetery amount of money where we could just live forever on um, or till I get bored, or really, or till you guys get bored. Um, I'll try to keep this and the Four Mortal Sisters on the same sort of. Um, oh, the Grim Reaper came with us. I mean, somebody downloaded a forest that I made. I don't made, I made, I made a forest because I was playing with a pixie sim, and I just absolutely love her. And I made, and I made a forest to put her in. But anyway, back to back to what I'm actually doing. So I'm gonna make some, make a little a little muddy bit. Um, should we have him going in a row, or should we have him? Yeah, let's have him. Let's have him in the row. Make it daytime, right? Yeah, that's that's enough. And we'll put a little rose down next to him because that's what the Black Widow does. She leaves a rose or some kind of rose. Um, yes, this rose is perfect. We'll leave him a pink. Or actually, no, a red rose. A red rose is perfectly ideal. And then I'll put his grave down. There we go. There he is. Um, I think I want to put him a bit further apart like that. And then I'll move this and put this a bit closer. And then we need to engrave the gravestone. And it needs to not rest in pieces. Um, what should we write this time? Last time we wrote Enticed by the Black Widow. This time we should write... Uh, you guys, if you guys have ever any good, like, um, engravements to put in the gravestones for when we've killed someone, please let me know because I'm sort of running out of ideas. Uh, gone but not forgotten. Enter some kind words to remember Peter by. Um... Death by Black Widow. Dot dot. <laughs> there we go. And we have three gravestones. One of them is from the Four and More Sisters, and one of them is for us. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.